compassion as youth and to help those that are hurting and to steer those in the right way that have gone astray. And uh, when I see now that they have legalized marijuana, it really hurts my heart because it's causing so many problems in our homes, in churches, wherever we go, it's causing a, a great deal of problem to legalize something that is destroying the minds of the youth. And these are the people of tomorrow. The repercussions behind that, what they just did, not only were they selfish, were they bought, were they whatever. It's just what's happening to the conscience of people nowadays. I don't care if you're a parent, I don't care if you're a politician, especially the politician to even have the thought that yes, legal licensing will be so great. Oh my God, it will be so. What led you to believe that legalizing a drug will have a, a difference or have a better impact? Come on, it's, it's not a reality. If you're telling them it's okay to smoke and we have rules in our home and you're telling them to go straight from the rules and the courtrooms are filled and you say, let's stop the violence. You're starting the violence, you're stirring up the violence. I would say, go back again and take it. Act like this was your child living in our neighborhoods and see how that feels. For the people that say, well, as long as it's not in my neighborhood, okay, but well, you're saying that. But what if it was in your neighborhood? What if they were that they open up shop in your neighborhood? Would you be all right with that? No. That if they really had a heart and they really cared about the people, and they would go back and look at this and say, this is harming our youth, it's killing our youth. You just talk about, we talk about the street violence, but it goes beyond the street violence. You're killing the youth, you're killing them mentally, so you are killing them. Go back and look at this bill again. How are we gonna get lenient with laws that we know are harmful to society and kids? I mean, you're really targeting the kids, let's just face it.